Oh, what is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video today. So, if you guys are brand new around here, I upload 45, well not 45, around 2 to 4 training methods a day. So if you guys do want to see these methods on my channel, make sure you guys do drop that subscribe button because you'll not miss a single upload of today. I'm going to upload 4 training methods a day, so if you guys do want to see that, make sure you guys do show your, show your support in the likes button down below. And also guys, come up, just, just, just alright, fuck that. Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video today. So if you guys are brand new around here, make sure you guys do smash that like away for fuck's sake. Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new train method today. So today's train method is really, really easy and really simple to do. And literally all we need is probably, say, it's quite a high budget method. So we need about 50,000 coins to do this method. So if you guys are brand new around it, I do upload four train methods a day. So make sure you guys do stay tuned for that. Or subscribe because you don't miss a single upload of the day. So... All we want to do is go and look for some expensive players, so people who are like 20,000 coins to 40,000 coins, somewhere around there. I say probably the 20,000 coin mark to 15,000 coin mark. So we keep flicking through, so for example, we see Pastore, we see Douglas Costa, we see uh, Joe Hart, um, we see Lam. So we see quite a few people, so we'll, we'll put Pastore in there, Lucas in there, um... Uh, Martins, uh, the Martins in there, and just say one more player. Let's go with Oscar. Now, to do this method, you need quite a lot of coins. Now, don't forget that if you guys want to make loads of coins, do well, do my way. But obviously, the other way is like um, people worth about five thousand coins to do that method. So pretty, so pretty much all what we need to do is go and look for Pastori first. What we want to do is go and check Pastori's cheapest by now on the market so we get a rough price of his card. Now if he goes around 16,000 coins to 18,000 coins we can make quite a bit of profit on him. So what we're, what we're going to do is going to check his cheapest band off at 24,000 coins, a bit too much of the market. So look, he's got, Pastor's going for about 12,000 coins. So we're going to check his cheapest band now just, just to double check. Uh, let's go ahead and check. Let's try 11,750, 12,250. 12, so he's going for uh, 13, so we're going to have 13.5k so or somewhere around there. So now what we want to do, we want to just quickly get rid of this and we want to go and check on the market. Now anything below 13,000 coins, we, we, well, we, we want to go bid on like 10,000, well, I'd about say about 11,000 coins so, so we can make um, 2,000 coin profit on each one. Now obviously that you have to get your criteria down to what, like 10,000 coins just for the, for the minimum max so, so you can go and bid on loads of them. So I'm going to go and Put ten thousand there, so what we're going to do is bid ten thousand, and at least my transfer target, so I can bid on them. So what we're going to do, we're going to bid ten thousand coins on all of these cars. Well, obviously not not for two days, but all these we bid for ten thousand coins. So we go like we win it, make around say about two and a half k profit on each one. That's the same with like uh, Douglas Costa before. That this is what I keep on doing. It's just going to put loads and loads and loads of bids on them. But the thing is, it actually works better with people with like five thousand coins because therefore a lot of people are like, oh yeah, you know what? Um, he's got five thousand coins that they're still in the market. It works better with people worth about like five thousand coins. So, so what we do is we're doing the for example like Douglas Costa. Go and check his cheapest in the market. His price has actually gone up, so we'll keep flicking through so we find cheapest in the market. So he's around 34,000 coins. So, yet again, what we want to do is obviously go and check like 30,000 coins, 31,000 coins, so we want to put like loads of bids on them. So, that's how you do the expensive way. Obviously, exactly the same with like with not the expensive players, so what we're typing goal. Like, for example, like Marsh, I'll be absolutely amazing one to do it with the uh, Manchester United striker. Like, people. Uh, around his price range will, will be very good to do it with. So we're going to type in Martial right now and he should be coming up. Uh, where is he? 79 rated. Why the hell is Martial? There we go. So what we do is we're going to check his, obviously going to check his cheapest by now on the market and then we'll go and check, uh, well, we're going to put a bid on him. So go right about 5 point, he's going to have about 4.7k, so we check 4.7, so he's around 4,700 coins. So what we want to do is we want to go and put some bids in for about 4,200 coins, so it makes about 500 coins. Look, as you can see, 
we're on the first page and it's like a fight of seconds. So martial arts are very, very, very good in Stuart. So yeah, that's how you that method obviously it works better off with uh, with um people of about martial arts about five K to say seven K somewhere around there. And therefore you can make quite a lot of profit. So I hope you guys did enjoy this training method. If you did, drop that thumbs up, subscribe if you are brand new around there. I've been Charlie, or CG Game here. And I'll see you guys later on. Peace.